Alright guys, Tom here and welcome to a new video and today we're doing Monday Night Raw for the 28th of October 2013 preview video and tonight's Monday Night Raw for the 28th of October 2013 comes on Amway Center, Orlando, Florida. The times of 8 Eastern, 5 Pacific, 8, 7 Central and 12 o'clock, not 1 o'clock, 12 o'clock UK time because the US times have not gone forward yet, so we've still got a 12 o'clock start time if you're living within the UK. Tweet me or Facebook me using the links in the description for a 720p HD live stream or a full show link. So you can do that if you want to watch it live or if you want to watch it after the show, both in 720p HD quality. So for tonight's Monday Night Raw, which is sure to be action-packed, Randy Orson became the new WWE champion last night at the Hell in a Cell 2013 pay-per-view after Shawn Michaels turned on the person he trained, Daniel Bryan. Expect Randy Orton to cut a promo about being the winner at the Hell in a Cell pay-per-view. Don't expect another Daniel Bryan and Randy Orton match, however, as it's gone as far as I believe it can go and the fans are really interested in seeing Daniel Bryan being stacked against the odds so many times. We're not really interested in seeing Daniel Bryan go into the a fourth pay-per-view wondering whether he'll lift the WWE WWE Championship off the corporation of Randy Orton and Triple H and Steffi McMahon. The feud's gone as far as it can go. I don't think any more fans are interested in seeing whether Daniel Bryan can overcome the odds and finally lift the WWE Championship only to be for it to be taken away the night after or on the actual show. There is a possibility this title, the WWE Championship, may be a part of the traditional Survivor Series matchup, which we get every Survivor Series every year. So they may possibly hint at this tonight on Monday Night Raw for Orton's WWE Championship. Orton, however, may even get a completely new opponent at Survivor Series, such as CM Punk or The Big Show. So for Daniel Bryan, he lost a hell of a lot of momentum last night at the Hell in a Cell 2013 pay-per-view after being screwed out of the title for the fourth pay-per-view in a row. With rumours of Triple H taking on Daniel Bryan at Survivor Series, we will get the initial build-up towards this match tonight on Monday Night Raw. Do expect Daniel Bryan to earn a lot of momentum tonight so the fans are still behind Daniel Bryan as much as they have been for the last few months. This could include another kick to Triple H's face or Daniel Bryan asking Triple H for a match at Survivor Series, all which will add some momentum towards Daniel Bryan and put him more over over with the crowd. Also, to keep Daniel Bryan as over as he has been in these last few months, Something big from Daniel Bryan must happen tonight on Monday Night Raw so he survives tonight's Monday Night Raw. This could come from a kick to Triple H's face or something very, very epic, epic where he disrupts the main event. Something needs to something needs to, to come from Daniel Bryan to get some momentum and stay over with the crowd considering he lost a hell of a lot of momentum last night after being screwed out of the title for the fourth time in the last four months. Also, Shawn Michaels, the question is whether HBK did in fact turn heel last night or was just making things even after Daniel Bryan kicked Shawn Michaels' best friend in the face, Triple H. I mean, a lot of people were saying he turned heel, but not necessarily. Shawn Michaels could just have been returning the favour after Daniel Bryan hit his finisher on Triple H. Shawn Michaels just returned the favour by doing that to Daniel Bryan. Expect some explanation from Shawn Michaels and Triple H to Tonight on Monday Night Raw, with Triple H probably doing the most talking out of both Shawn Michaels and Triple H. This part of the show will be the most interesting as it could go down a few different routes. HBK could still be, be face, he could be heel, or he could be both. We just don't know. Something's got to give. You've got to wonder which road that they're going to go down for this segment. It's all to be answered for on tonight's Monday Night Raw. And Shawn Michaels might not even be on tonight's Monday Night Raw. It might just be Triple H explaining HBK's actions. We don't know, so I'm sure that'll be interesting tonight on Monday Night Raw. Also, John Cena became a three-time, yes, a three-time, three-time, three-time World Heavyweight Champion last night at the Hell in a Cell 2013 pay-per-view, of course. John Cena tweeted out he was going to add some respect to the title belt once and for all. Expect Cena to cut a promo with 
these words just slightly more elaborated. And that brings me on to the next factor, Damien Sandow. With wins over Dolcega on main event and of course Kofi Kingston on the kickoff show, Damien Sandow, it wouldn't be a surprise if he does in fact cash in on tonight's Monday Night Raw. It might be a little bit of wishful, wishful thinking on my part, but with many people expecting it to come last night on the pay-per-view, maybe an attack by Del Rio on Cena tonight on Monday Night Raw could make Sandow cash in. The same happened with Dolce at Mania, and then he cashed in the night after at Monday Night Raw with that really cool crowd. And it could easily happen tonight on Cena to set up a Survivor Series feud, as people are sick of Del Rio being in the title picture for the World Heavyweight title. He's been in there since January, and also people aren't very happy that John Cena is the World Heavyweight Champion after not really earning a title shot. So it'd be great to see Damian Sandow cash in. That's definitely a possibility on tonight's Monday Night Raw, and they could use this basically to make up for a pretty piss poor pay-per-view. Also, CM Punk. With CM Punk seemingly ending the feud against Paul Heyman at the Hand in the Soul pay-per-view, what is next for the straight-edge superstar CM Punk? There are a few rumours he may be taking time out at the end of 2013 so he can recuperate for a possible WrestleMania 30 main event and a Royal Rumble 2014 win. This could, by the time... This could this could mean that they may lay off Punk for a while instead of throwing him in a meaningless feud for Survivor Series. So it might be tonight on Monday Night Raw they lay off CM Punk for a while because they don't have any decent plans for CM Punk at Survivor Series. Because Punk doesn't need a f he doesn't need a win he doesn't need a match he's got some good momentum going for him at the moment he's had two decent wins over Ryback in some pretty stacked matches against him so he doesn't really need a match at Survivor Series. So for me it'd be the perfect time for CM Punk to go away and recuperate if he is going to considering Cena has now returned and Punk's had two straight pay-per-view wins it's a great time for Punk to go away so don't be surprised if CM Punk goes away on tonight's Monday Night Raw. Speaking of returns with John Cena Kane did in fact return last night but it was a pretty lame and boring segment for Kane. It seemed as though Kane returned as a face at first but then turned on the Miz. Is this a heel turn for Kane and what will he have in store for the poster boys of Survivor Series the Wyatt family? Will he join the team of the Wyatt family or simply have a rematch against Bray Wyatt from SummerSlam 2013? Also the Divas Championship AJ Lee yet again defeated another Diva. There is a lack of Divas she can still defend her title against so will somebody step up to the plate such as Nikki Bella or Exana. They're apparently very high on Exana at the moment, so it'll be interesting to see who steps up to the plate for the Divas title, considering she's nearly knocked off everybody in the division. So that's Monday Night Raw for you tonight, guys. Hopefully everything happens, and hopefully we have a good show on our hands. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, guys. Tweet me and Facebook me for 720p HD live stream links and full show links. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Subscribe, take care, spite hair, comment your thoughts, and like the video. Goodbye.